So the 56th Brabant Appel looks like this, leaving Leuven and heading southwest before heading up to pay homage to its former finish through Nivelle, the first hill of the day coming at the Rue de Al, then the Alsenberg where this race used to finish, Brunneput, and then back in towards Nivelle, and to the three local finishing laps of 23.4 kilometers, four times across the line in Overese, finishing with that final 26th hilling, the Schave. It was so close for Tom Bonin at the weekend at Paris-Roubaix. Guillaume von Kerspoek from Roubaix to the hills says he's working for his team today. He's working for the likes of Alaphilippe and Vakoc. Edict Quickstep, as ever, with a mightily strong team. Mersman's here, Sedi, as is Vermoot and Martinelli. One long line of riders, 85 kilometers remaining in the 56th Brabant Appel. 42 seconds of an advantage over the peloton. Now, is this going to settle down again? Because Daryl Impey in here, alongside Deby and Etix Quickstep Sedi, means that this is an extremely strong group. And this is all that's left of the peloton. Alaphilippe. And Wellens. The last rondo, the last lap. 11 seconds. Alaphilippe showing that he's ever so slightly stronger than Wellens at the minute. 15 seconds. The gap grows again. Any hesitation is going to play into these guys' hands. So what a group this is. Alaphilippe, Tanner, Galopin, Vakoc and Gasparotto. Final left-hand turn and then they're on to Scave for good. It's about 700 metres from here. Last wheel in the white, it's Tan on the left-hand side. You can see Vakoc and Vakoc is attacking now the Czech champion. Alaphilippe's done his job. It's Vakoc going, dragging two riders with him. Tanner is dead as well at the back. It is Vakoc in the Czech champion's jersey. Kokar is with him, but at the moment it is Vakoc riding away. Petr Vakoc, leader for the day at Edix Quickstep, is surely going to take the victory all on his own. 23 years of age from the Czech Republic. It is going to be a third win of the season for Petr Vakoc. Chance for a look round, even time for a celebration. What a brab on Sapel. Attacks all day long. It's Edix Quickstep who win. And Petr Vakoc with victory number three of 2016. Peter Vakoc wins Brabant Appel 2016 ahead of Enrico Gasparotto, the Italian, very close to his first win in four years. Tony Gallopa in third place with another Frenchman, Kokao, winning the sprint for fourth ahead of Michael Matthews in fifth. Colbrelli, Lamertink, Alaphilippe, Slachter and Fliegen make up a very, very high quality top ten. Plenty of modesty, but also aware of his powers and possibilities. Today he showed them. Vakoc the winner of Brabant Appel 2016.